My name is Ryan De Souza. I'm the curator of the Nobody's Listening Art and Virtual Reality Immersive Exhibition. We're delighted to be here at the US Institute of Peace. Nobody's Listening aims to use art and virtual reality to highlight the atrocities committed by ISIS against ethno-religious communities in 2014 in northern Iraq. The centerpiece of the Nobis Listening exhibition is a virtual reality experience that we filmed in Sinjar in 2019, where you get to walk around the scenes where the crimes took place whilst listening to testimony by survivors that we collected from the public domain. Ask any Yazidi what they want most, and they will say, to find our missing women and children. One of the most powerful paintings in the exhibition is one by Ivana Walid. Ivana is a human rights activist and Yazidi genocide survivor. The painting we have here is a faceless woman, which for me symbolizes um, the painful uh, brutality of what the women went through in ISIS captivity, but also highlights um, the resilience of a number of these survivors who have turned into human rights champions for their community. The exhibition is called Nobody's Listening, which is a refrain that I heard from a number of Yazidi and other community members over the course of the production of the exhibition. We wanted to create this tree of solidarity as a way of, for people to express their solidarity with the communities and to show that they are listening. There are different uh, ribbons with different advocacy goals and different colours that people can tie on this tree and we hope by the end of this exhibition the tree will be full of colour and in this is very much in keeping with the Yazidi custom and tradition of tying ribbons for good luck. But we also want people to know that these types of crimes are still ongoing in different parts of the world and it's incumbent on all of us as human beings to do more to help those that are being affected 